It's and 7 o'clock. Next time, though. Yeah, I, and I we have four meetings down. that are all scheduled for 7 o'clock. We're going to do them in order. First, we'll do Cunningham Township. We'll have a public hearing on the budget for the township. That'll be followed by a meeting of the Cunningham Town Board. We will have a public hearing on the Urbana City budget, and that will be followed by a meeting of the Urbana City Council. So is there anyone here who would like to testify at the public hearing for Cunningham Township? I hear a deafening silence. No one wants to talk about that. So since there's no one here to talk about it, I will close the hearing and let us open the meeting of the Cunningham Town Board. Would the clerk please call the roll? Mr. Bowersox Johnson. Present. Mr. Jacobson. Mr. Lewis. Here. Ms. Marlin. Here. Mr. Roberts. Here. Mr. Smythe. Here. Ms. Stevenson. Mayor Pressing. Here. Is there anyone who would like to address the Cunningham Town Board? <coughs> Apparently not. Um, the first item is adoption of the budget and appropriation ordinance. Carol, would you like to comment on that? Sure, this is um, an amended budget and appropriation ordinance for the current fiscal year that we are in, uh, fiscal 11-12. I sent electronically and I also provided for you tonight a, a copy of the final budget and a summary of the line items that were adjusted in the amended budget. Um, normally we would do line item transfers in this situation, but the amount needed in personal allowances exceeds the legal amount um, that we can do by line item transfers, so we just amended the whole thing. And other than the personal allowance line item, it's a fairly normal budget. We were actually under budget in a number of areas. Um, and again, the the amounts that show up on the for the Carl repayment kind of skew where we are with this. I think in total the expenditures were still under budget it, of the original amount. It's just that line items were adjusted, and in revenues, the general assistance revenues exceeded a bit what was um, originally budgeted due to some lieu and tax money and also some. Uh, the SSI reimbursement and some medical bill um, refunds. Oh. Um, ironically, in general assistance, the amount budgeted for medical care, I was able to reduce the amount budgeted, um, and I don't think that means that we're we're not paying as much medical. I think it's a matter of timing of how we get the bills. It's the prescription bills that we get come in huge stacks, and I think there's a stack ready to pay in July, which will show up on that budget, but um, I did adjust it for this budget so the the increase wouldn't be quite so um, much. Uh, and this would be it then for this fiscal year, and we would also need a, a roll call vote for this. Okay. Is there a motion for the adoption of the fiscal 2011-12 uh, amended budget and appropriation ordinance? So moved. I'll second. second. Okay, motion by Charlie Smythe, seconded by Dennis Roberts. Any discussion? Mayor? Charlie. Okay, yeah, Carol, I just, you know, we get the chart, and we've seen the numbers going up. Mm -hmm. That's This re is reflected in the personal allowances going up, right? Correct, uh, yeah. yes. And so, you know, every month, you know, you give us a revised number here at the tail end, and, and these have been steadily going up. Do you, do you, do you have a revised number yet for, the, for, for June? Not for June yet. Um, when we, in July, when we have the meeting, we'll have more of them because then we'll have the July right. numbers. Um, what happens is, and sometimes, sometimes we should talk about this more, the application process, that people are constantly applying for assistance and cases are being closed out for one reason or another, so there's all this turnover um, with new people and old people and for the last three or four years, we've been keeping track of the number of applications coming and going, and I hope to be able to put together that for you just to see where, you know, Yeah, and, and this, is. this becomes the issue that I raised, you know, either last year or six months ago as we saw these numbers going up that yes. we need to look at how this affects the, the township budget coming up 
and how long we can sustain it yes. at, at those levels. So um, I, I think that's a discussion we should be prepared to have as we as we go into the next township budget. Yes, I agree. Yeah. Anyone else? Would the clerk please call the roll? Mr. Bowersox Johnson? Yes. Mr. Lewis? Yes. Ms. Marlin? Yes. Mr. Roberts? Yes. Mr. Smythe? Here. Yes. <laughs> Ms. Stevenson? Yes. That motion carries. There being no further business, let's adjourn this meeting. <laughs>